was your reaction to, to being traded and, and being traded here? I mean, I was excited, man, just to get a new opportunity and just to meet more people and more people in the basketball world. And I mean, coming to a great organization like the Wizards, I mean, and in the nation's capital, I mean, it was definitely, uh, I was definitely excited. How would you kind of describe, uh, you know, where you're at in your career, what you've uh, been able to do so far and what, what you kind of hope to do? Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, at least for right now, uh, I've been uh, just learning, really, just learning and learning the NBA style, the play style, the just the plays, the onsets, offsets, uh, nuances of, of, of the game, really. So, I mean, just learning. And, I mean, I feel like my, my, talent is, my talent is there. It's just the little things uh, that I need to, uh, like, just like, just like, uh, just learn the game, really. So, that's it, really. Around here who aren't familiar with your game, mm -hmm. how do you describe what you bring to the court? Mm -hmm. I mean, first, first and foremost, I'm, I feel like I'm a good teammate. Just picking my uh, picking my teammates up. Um, at least for my game, I feel like I'm a versatile player. I, I uh, score inside and out, um, block shots, rebound. Uh, just do, do a little bit of everything, really. So. What was the experience like playing Greensboro? Mm -hmm. uh, when you did? Oh yeah, de uh, definitely. Just boost. Uh, just not. I mean, just playing. Really, that was just the main thing for me. Uh, just being able to play, um, definitely helped me out a lot. Just, uh, <clears throat> just, just the NBA game. Going, uh, playing in the G League uh, definitely helped me. Did you uh, know anyone uh, on the team or part of the organization before you got here? Any prior relationships? Uh, I know. I knew uh, Isaiah. Isaiah Todd, just from uh, USA Basketball and. Uh, just playing, uh, playing up, growing up and playing with, against them in the uh, circuits. Did, uh, did Kevin and the dad who play major college sports and, and pro football help you prepare for this, this life, this career? Uh, it definitely helped me uh, prepare a little bit for this uh, career just to, just with his um, his motivation that uh, motivation that he gave me and just his words of, of encouragement and wisdom. You, uh, you had a pre workout with Jason, right? Uh, yeah, okay. yeah. Um, what do you remember about that? Um, I mean, I think the only one that was there was Tommy, uh, Tommy and someone else. So, I mean, uh, <clears throat> I mean, it was definitely, uh, I was definitely excited just to be able to have him watch me and have me uh, see what I can do and stuff like that. So it definitely was exciting. What do you think about the opportunity you have here? And, and I guess look at the, the roster and consider how you can fit in there. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, I mean, I'm just. I feel like definitely there's definitely an opportunity. Just um, just come. I just need to come here and work hard and just yeah, just just pretty much just work my ass out. That's it, really. Over these uh, two years you've been a pro, what have been some of the the veteran guys or the older players? Who has uh, given you the best advice? <clears throat> you mean just from just from NBA, just from like the Hornets, or just from yeah, the Hornets, or just or NBA, any NBA, NBA players? Or any NBA mm -hmm. uh, just guys like Brandon Knight, Andre Drummond, uh, Ish. He's been definitely Ish has helped me a lot. Um, just those, pretty much like those those guys, really. What was it like getting traded for the first time mm -hmm. in your career? Um, it was definitely uh, something new. I um, mean, uh, yeah, the first thing, uh, first time it ever happened. So I mean, definitely something new. Um, but it's just a new opportunity and a better experience to learn. What's it been like so far with Coach last season? Yes, sir. What's that been like for you to see on that? Um, yeah, it was definitely, <clears throat> I was thinking about trying to get up there to a game, hopefully before the uh, season uh, ends, but, um, I mean, just Coach K and his legacy at Duke is unreal. I mean, the way he leads his guys and develops them and helps them is definitely a nice, uh, definitely really good. Christos? 
Hey, Vernon, first of all, have a great journey in DC with the Wizards. Mm-hmm. Uh, I would like to ask you, Ish Smith knows pretty well the, the locker room, the environment in the, in the team. How help you to get acclimated in this team? And what do you like most about the Wizards so far? Um, just the connection that everyone has with each other. Um, everyone's everyone's uh, friendly, everyone's welcoming, everyone's nice. I mean, everyone, I mean, everyone's good guys. I mean, that's why <clears throat> that's pretty much one of the good things about uh, the organization. Everyone's good guys. And also, what did you learn in those one and a half year at, uh, at Hornets, mm-hmm. about your first one and a half year? What did you learn and what would you like to bring in the team from uh, until the end of the season? Um, yeah, I mean, really, uh, when I came to the Hornets, I, I learned uh, just like I learned the NBA style and the play style and stuff like that. Uh, just that it's a huge adjustment from college. So, I mean, that's something I definitely learned from the Hornets and that. Uh, definitely trying to bring it over here to the Wizards. Thank you very much. Thank you. Neil. Hey, Vernon. Um, I'm just curious in your conversations with other people, Tommy, Coach, you know, what have they expected and desired for you, you know, the rest of the season? Yeah, I mean, uh, I mean, I've been ta- uh, talk to ta- I talked to Tommy and just, he just, I mean, just working hard. That's it for the rest of the year. And he said he has a plan for me. So, yeah, just all I can do is just uh, control what I can control. So, I mean, just coming in and working hard every day. Thanks. Welcome to D.C. Appreciate you.